Hey, welcome back to Sleeping Sessions. This time we're going to talk about the uh, news that's just come out um, this evening, as of the time I'm recording this, um, that Mickey Moore from Cheltenham has been appointed by Shrewsbury Town FC as the new director of football. And um, there's a lot of chat on the social media channels that I follow um, from Shrewsbury Town fans about this decision. And a lot of people are assuming that it means that Steve Cottrell will, will be going. Um, although that hasn't technically been said yet. And um, I am aware that Cheltenham, where Mickey's coming from, um, do have someone who they call a manager, um, as well as the director of football. Um, it's arguable whether um, Wade Elliott is a manager or a head coach and what the difference between those two roles are, what the difference between a manager and a director of football are. Um, but it does mean that maybe Shrewsbury might have a similar sort of setup where it could be um, maybe Cox would stay um, in that sort of managerial head coach capacity as well as having a director of football. Um, yet to be seen whether that will really materialise. I don't know if um, it might be a bit of a, this town isn't big enough for the two of us situation. Um, but if it does happen, whether it would be a good thing or a bad thing, um, a lot of the fans seem to like Cots. I like Cots as well. Um, I don't always agree with everything that he's done or said. Um, but then you never really do as a football fan. Um, uh, but you know what, he's been in position since 2020, um, in the 2021 season um, we finished 17th, 21-22, we finished 18th and then this year um, we finished in 12th which is quite a good improvement um, but it's still not exactly in those top echelons of the uh, league table that we want to be aiming for um, to sort of step forward a bit and um, we've been in League One for quite some time now um, and the only movement we've had is down and then up again uh, over the years um, so it's kind of like what do we really want as a club what do we want as fans do we want to move forward and um, potentially have a promotion push and I know that's obviously what the team and what Cops really want but have they been given uh, what they need to do that maybe this Mickey Moore, if we give him a chance, will provide that sort of thing. Because he was with the Robins for about four and a half years, um, before now. And um, he started as a head of recruitment and uh, made a lot of good recruitment choices. Um, they were fourth in League Two in 2019-20. And 2020-21, they, they won League uh, two, so they were promoted, they were in first place. Then 21 22, um, 15th in League One, so actually better than uh, Shrewsbury did that season. And then 22 23, they were 16th in League One, um, so not quite as good as Shrewsbury this time. But you've got to think with that promotion thing, um, he's come up with them. Um, maybe he is someone who can maybe push us a bit further in that respect. And I'm just playing devil's advocate here. I'm not saying that this is a brilliant decision or that he's going to come in and everything's going to suddenly be all roses. Um, and I'm not trying to disparage Cots too much. Um, obviously, um, a lot of my um, subscribers will know that I'm a relatively new fan of Shrewsbury Town. Um, so I can't say that I have enough experience in knowing um, you know, the ins and outs of how well um, Cots has done or how well regarded he is. But I get the feeling that a lot of people like him, so um, I'm not sort of saying anything negative about him. But personally, I would hope that we want to move forward, we want to move up. And um, if Cots is not the right person to do that, then so be it. And if um, Mickey is the right person, then great. And obviously those are two big ifs, and I'm not saying that will happen. But I think we need to think positively. 
this decision has been made. Um, Mickey is coming over to Shrewsbury, so we should embrace it and embrace him with open arms and uh, welcome him as uh, one of the family and hopefully together move forward in a sort of more positive sense. Um, obviously the way it's all been handled by the club has not been ideal, uh, far from ideal. Um, leaving us fans in the dark, leaving cops in the dark. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if he moves on. We might even have news tomorrow um, saying that he's decided to leave after this uh, has been confirmed. But um, if he does, then we wish him good luck. And if he doesn't, then great. It means that us as a club with Cots and with Mickey can move forward. Um, so yeah, it's all sort of up in the air. It remains to be seen. Um, but hopefully better days are ahead. Um, so come on, Sam.